the Top Greener booth and I'm chatting with Kyle Meglin and he's going to show us USB-C receptacles, which I think is much more interesting than that sounds, right? Sounds good. So over here, we're Top Greener, like she said. We started in the USB market. Um, we have the largest amount of configurations for USB in wall products. But what we'll do is start here with our triple USB port. This is your standard USB-A port. You get up to 5.8 amps of charging power, 2.4 amps per port, and then you also still get to keep your two AC outlets. So it's really great for families who have lots of devices to charge, but not a whole lot of space. So, so then I'm going to talk also to the audio only audiences. What we're talking about is is not something that plugs into your outlet, but replaces your outlet, correct? Exactly, yes. So, so when this one we're looking at here has the two standard uh, uh, power ports, but it's also got three USB-A, and what are these here? So these are just your standard AC outlet. Just oh, that's for, the other yep. half of that. Just plug it in. Yeah. Getting confused by exactly. that. Exactly. So can I ask you how big that is back behind it? Because you do have to have, I think, a little bit bulkier, bigger box yeah. area. So they're actually not too much thicker than a standard receptacle and they, they wire like a standard receptacle as well. So you don't have to have any specialty wires. A neutral wire is a problem for people with older homes, um, but that's not an issue here. And really in terms of space, you should be absolutely fine. Okay. So this yeah. is adding three USB-A ports. Yes. Absolutely. All right. And then what else you got? So then we move down to where we have a couple of different configurations that include USB-C. And so what's great about USB-C is a lot of new phone companies, yep. uh, you know, e-readers, tablets, even some, some MacBooks, that's an example yep. of one that's moving into the USB-C space. Um, so that's just great. It provides you a combined six amps, three amps per port. So you're going to get a nice fast charge out of there. So you can charge a MacBook Pro out of a, a three amp port? Well, no, not quite. So we have a different model for that. Okay. So this is where it gets a little tricky. So this is maybe more phones at this point. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Phones, tablets, things like that, that don't require a whole lot of uh, juice or oomph, right, I guess. Right. Yeah. That's my technical word for it as yeah. well. I'm a mechanical <laughs> engineer and I never got that stuff. Yeah. Okay, so moving on. So then we come over to here. This one is actually our, our prized possession. This one, Wirecutter's best USB outlet of 2018. Um, so you get your standard USB-A port, 2.4 uh, amp output, and then three amps in the USB-C. So that's kind of like best of both worlds. If One you of have, each, yeah. Yeah, old or new devices. And so moving on from there is where it gets really technical. Oh, I see it. I see my favorite two letters, PD for yes. power delivery. You got it. You know, you should do this for a living or I know, something. Oh, really? I should. <laughs> so this one right here, this is one of the first ones that we came out with. It has Qualcomm Quick Charge 3.0. And so what's great about that is that it's actually, we actually work with them and it's certified. So you know you're getting the product that you need. I like certified when it comes to my electricity. Absolutely. And all of our products are UL listed, FCC compliant where it's necessary. So really you're getting a, you know, something that's not going to burn your house down. So power delivery. So can I do my MacBook Pro in that port? You cannot. However, <laughs> we're so close. We are getting closer, I promise. You're teasing me. Yeah. You're teasing me here, Kyle. <laughs> yeah, so but power delivery is great for newer phones. It's just a more efficient way to charge. Okay, so the one we're looking at right now that has a standard outlet plus the USB 3.0 and power delivery. You got in it. In USB C. You got All it. All right, so we, we lost one of our, our ports, our, our uh, power plugs, our receptacles in order to get b uh, both of those. We did. But we're coming back for redemption with, with the newest version. These two here are going to be coming out in mid-2020. I heard May, but don't quote me on that. I don't want to be liable. Okay. Um, but so what's great about this is it's the same exact thing, except here you're getting, you're getting the, um, the, second, the second AC port. Okay, so we've got two AC ports. We've got mm -hmm. power delivery. Now, now it's saying 30 watts, though. Oh, yeah. So we're, bump, we're bumping up the power on that one. So what we actually are doing, a lot of the, the power needs for USB-C comes into the laptops. Your typical uh, laptop or like a, I, I said the Mac was an example, the MacBook. Mac, MacBook's like 65 watts. Yeah, 60 to 65. So actually right here in this one, this is where we're moving into serving those people. This is made with gallium nitride. It's new technology for us. It's just a much faster and more efficient way to, I guess, harness power is what we're going to say. But so this is actually 60 watts. So you 60 can- 60 watts. And it even says gallium nitride on it. Sure does. Yeah. So that's that's for our people who um, have a whole lot of devices and you know you don't need to brick. You don't have to lose outlet space with your big old adapter. So- Right. So we've got two power outlet, AC power outlets. We've got power delivery at 60 watts. and. Uh, 
uh, quick charge 3.0 at 27 watts. You got it. That's crazy. So those those last two are not out yet. They're not out yet. But What's they your? Will do you know what your price point's going to be on the last one? Ah, oh, that's a good question. <laughs> um, so pretty much they all start from anywhere from $13 up to $35. But since these ones are such high output, I'd probably say it's going to be in the $40 dollar range. Okay, so. but I don't have to sell a kidney to get it. You can if you want to, <laughs> but I wouldn't advise it. I have a lot of change left over is what you're saying. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. And then you could just buy more. Very good. Yeah. Uh, so I'm, I could read you the uh, the name of this, but it's got a whole bunch of letters and numbers in it. So where would people go to find out more about these fine products? So you can go to topgreener.com backslash 2020. That's where we'll have all of our information, our online catalogs, um, and then from there, you'll be able to go to the store, browse our products. If you're not a fan of buying online, paying for shipping, you're a Prime member. We also sell on Amazon. Oh, very good. We'll be getting my Amazon affiliate links on that one there then. There you go. Absolutely. All right. Thank you very much for your time, Kyle. Sounds great.